Hey everyone, Sam Battersby from Griot's Garage, and today we're going to talk about the Boss Foam Cannon. Living up to our Strive for Perfection slogan, we elected to take the best that exists and make it better. Its improved design features stainless steel manifold construction, a stainless steel barrel, and stainless internals. The internals were re-engineered in-house to increase foam output and performance. The Cannon features our proprietary auto mix metering system that lets you dispense product without the need to premix a micro detergent regulator for adjusting your fluid flow from the reservoir, and a patented one-way vented cap that eliminates the risk of spilling if the cannon tips over. The wide mouth cap is also double threaded to accept our 22 and 35 ounce bottles that can be screwed directly to the cannon in place of the reservoir. At the business end of the cannon, you find the adjustable fan nozzle that allows you to dial in a zero to 40 degree spray pattern. Other Canon highlights include a wide base, 33.8 ounce reservoir that prevents the Canon from tipping over when it's set down, a large mouth jar that necessitates easy reservoir filling, a chemical resistant silicone pickup tube for improved flex and durability, and a stainless steel pickup ball that accepts our auto mix metering tips. Using the Canon is simple. Once you've chosen the appropriate foaming system liquid, select whether you want to employ the auto mix metering system or the traditional manual mix method. The auto mix metering system allows you to choose one of the three SureFlow metering tips based on your pressure washer setup. The pink tip is for gas powered units rated at 2200 PSI or more, purple tip for electric pressure washers under 2200 PSI, and the aqua tip is for maximum foam regardless of the pressure washer. Insert the appropriate metering tip into the pickup ball. Now you can elect to thread a 35 ounce bottle directly to the cannon or pour the product straight into the reservoir. If you're using the manual mixing method at a 20 to 1 dilution ratio, add one and a half to two ounces of your selected foaming system concentrate and fill the balance of the reservoir with water. Run the cannon with no metering tip installed. Now connect your Boss Foam Cannon to your pressure washer via the included stainless steel quick disconnect coupler. We also offer a stainless steel threaded direct adapter that attaches the cannon directly to the gun portion. Both of these adapters will fit most pressure washers. Now with your cannon locked and loaded, it's time to have some fun. Start foaming directly onto a dry surface from the bottom up. Working in slow and methodical overlapping passes, spread a thick, even layer of foam. Cover the entire vehicle and allow the foam to dwell for five to 10 minutes, but do not let it dry. It should be noted that dwell time will depend greatly on the environment that you're washing in. Warmer climates will result in less dwell time. After the foam has worked its magic, do a thorough rinse, again starting from the bottom working your way up, and work in slow, methodical, overlapping passes, being sure that every single surface is rinsed. This is where you'll remove as much residual abrasive contaminant as possible before you ever need to touch the car. Once the entire vehicle has been rinsed, evaluate the surface to determine whether you need a mitten bucket wash or if you can proceed straight to the next step. If you're not satisfied with the foam output from the Boss Foam Cannon, specifically if you're running a lower powered electric pressure washer that is 2200 PSI or below, we include a secondary manifold jet with a 1.1 millimeter orifice that will increase your foam output when using the Cannon with lower powered pressure washers. To install the jet, simply remove your coupler from the Cannon. Using a flathead screwdriver, thread out the original manifold jet and install the included 1.1 millimeter manifold jet. Tighten down until snug, but do not over tighten. No sealant or thread tape is needed here. Then reinstall your coupler, not forgetting the thread tape or sealant at this point. Now you're ready to enjoy mountains of flying foam. Thank you for watching. For more information on the Boss Foam Cannon, be sure to visit griotsgarage.com. And as always, have fun in your garage.